Well, well, hello there, everybody. It's been a while. Not really. <laughs> um, how are you guys doing today? Welcome back, King Rara right here, and I'm your host for this evening. Well, which I should be saying. So you're probably wondering, what the heck are you doing now, King Rara? What is this horrendous looking thing? Well, I'm down below my basement. Actually, in my mind, to be exact. Oh, I heard a zombie. I heard a zombie. And what I'm doing is I'm getting ready for a mana generator. A fairly large one at that. So, I dug out this nice area, used my void tier to absorb up all the bad stuff flight potion to fly around to do this and I made myself an Electrum pickaxe. The Electrum was on accident but after I found out that it was better than the silver I was about to use but um, speed wise it's a little better with um, durability also but not very much I decided why not max this baby out so I maxed it out well kind of I still got one um, modifier on it that way I can put uh, luck on it whenever I get some lapis lazuli so I'm filling in the water with the Emperor's Chalice which I made a couple episodes ago and you guys thought I wasn't going to need it ho 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 I proved you wrong so my um, generator is going to run off of hy hydro geese, hydro guts, hydro. Ugh, can never say it properly. The water flower! There we go! <laughs> we are going to put water flowers here. Of course, we're going to need dirt to get started, but I thought, why not make the towers first? The mana towers, I like to call them need that space in order to get to that corner over there we'll have a mana um, dispenser right about here and here following over to this direction where I can put a mana um, pool right over here but first as I said we would like to get these mana towers completed. So I'm thinking maybe four mana towers. That's really all the room I have, unless I push that wall back and do another two. Six mana towers would actually be a pretty great idea. Um, but for now, let's go with four and see how that does us on a that. right click your void tier to get one stack right now I have it on absorb anything that is cobblestone more than a stack which is good for keeping your inventory nice and clean of cobblestone I mean I could possibly carry a couple of void tiers around you know what I forgot to do here Add water. Okay. Emperor's Chalice stick? Oh no. Okay, so shift right clicking the Emperor's Chalice will get rid of the water. <laughs> we do not want to do that. Okay, so once I'm done here, I'll be right back with you guys. Okay guys, so we managed to fit in a couple more uh, generators. Um, so basically, what I did to make up for the loss of space is I put this wall back. That way we can put the mana pool that we desire there. Now let's get out some torches and make sure this place is lit up a bit. We don't want mobs, especially creepers, spawning down here, causing us a bunch of problems. 
Um, yeah, we're kind of low on torches, so let's go get some. Coal. Sticks. That is a loud portal. <laughs> Alright. Torch. This up like so. Alright, now what we need is dirt. Uh, let's get a stack of dirt and see if that's good enough. But before we continue on this build, we've got something that we want to build. I'm going to timestamp this at 2.21 p.m. Central Standard Time. And tell me what you think we're going to be making here. Make sure you stamp yours. And then let's get to making it, shall we? Um, let's see here. Crafting station. Glowstone on both sides. Diamond on the bottom. No, middle. And an energy collector in K1. Now, that energy collector is going to very, very slowly gain energy for us. But now we've got a steady case of. Yeah, steady. A uh, case of. Um, energy going into the energy collector or being stored right here now the last thing we want to do is this stamp at 2:23 p.m. central standard time now first we want to make a spectral a specter iron we put those there um, I probably looked at the wrong recipe whenever I first looked at this. Spectre, Spectre. I want to make the Spectre sword. Oh yeah, the obsidian stick. So that's why I had those two. So you put it like that, you get three obsidian sticks, you just need one of them. And there you go. A Spectre Sword. Now, you're probably wondering, why are you giving up your good sword for this iffy sword? Well, I'm not giving it up. We are going to be using this iffy sword here shortly. Probably not this episode. To, um, go around and kill some Spectres. It gives you a higher chance of Spectre spawning whenever a... Um, you kill a mob with it. I apologize for uh, any inconvenience in the background noise. Currently, my grandfather is sick. He's been sick for a little bit. Um, alright, so what we wanted was a stack of dirt. Now, with the stack of dirt that we are going to be placing on top of each piece of dirt, the hydro... Hydrogia, hydrogia, I guess is how you say it. But the reason why we want a sack is to make sure we have enough to go over here and put them where they belong. So, up and at them through the hole and over here. This first block got to go. Put that there. Um... All right, so for these two areas, I'm not going to fully put all the dirts because we need to make sure we are able to get, ooh, the, the dirt. Ah, oh, darn it, come on now, there we go. Whenever we're placing the hydro, hydro juice, hyd let's just call it the water flower. <laughs> What am I doing? I, it needs to be like that. Yeah, it needs to be on the same turf. Oh, no, 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 no. Yep, I now remember where it is. <laughs> oh, boy. We're making boo-boos left and right, aren't we? Boo-boos. We don't need to make no boo-boos. <laughs> okay. 
Okay, that's good though. Like this is how we want it. Oh. Um, yeah, that's right, that's right. Destroy that. Place that there. I've got an OP pick here, so I've got to be extremely careful when mining with it, otherwise you have problems like I'm having. No! I'm putting the wrong stuff down. You and you. Wow, that uses up a lot of dirt. I need a lot more than I thought I needed. Okay, so I've got a ton of chests and I have no clue where everything is. Hopefully I've got plenty of dirt to complete this. Eight dirt. Oh boy. We do not have plenty of dirt, but guess what a good thing is is that we can go over here and make extra dirt not that we really need that much dirt now do we okay so with seven extra dirt we should be able to go down here and finish up the areas okay so while flying it is kind of difficult to um, <clears throat> break dirt blocks it takes a bit of time so there is an item that I'd like to make from Tinker's Construct it is called the glove the traveler's glove so to make the traveler's glove you're going to need I believe six pieces of leather I happen to have seven pieces oh got a backpack in here too I wonder what happened to... I'm supposed to have two backpacks. Um, okay. Table over here. So we go like that. So that is exactly six pieces. Now we should be able to find some redstone, perhaps? Yes, redstone. Now this is going to make our mining ridiculously fast. So, let's do it like that, break that down, go like that, alright, one, two, three, one there, Whoa, what was that noise? One remainder. So we go like that. Three. And one. And there we go. Now, how about we go find out what that odd noise was? Because that was something else. Put this up. Before we go and get ourselves killed, let's drink some fire potion. Let's regeneration. Flight. And fill up our hunger bar. Okay, so we heard some odd noise. this direction, but I don't see anything. Hmm. There's our old hidey hole. Look at that, I can one-shot zombies. 
Oh, oh, let's get our um, Spectre Blade out. That's a hungry. I do not want to fight a hungry. They're pains in the butts. Take your stuff away from you while you're fighting them. Nope, he didn't drop anything. Yes! Spectre! 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 Come here! They're so hard to kill because they... Ah! It's best to fight these guys in small rooms with a ceiling. Then you actually can get to them and kill them with ease. Well, not necessarily with ease, but we got an Ender Pearl. All right, well, that's enough fun for one day. We still got some um, stuff we need to make. So let's get there and do it. Okay, now that we've completed this area, what we're going to now do is make some water flowers. Now we'll need the Lexica Botania. Go to generating flowers. And it's called the Hydroangus. Hydroangus, I guess. Hy Hydroangus. Something like that. Let's go over to the way they're made and add it as a bookmark. Now we're going to need one pink, one mystical, two mystical, cyan, one cyan mana, one blue mana, and one blue. So, if that made any sense to anybody, give a big fat like and subscribe. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to want to make sure... I have some things in the ready. Oh, shoot. Come here, baby. There we go. Uh, the one thing I want to make sure I have ready is my saturation potion. That's the one thing I need to make sure I have ready. All right, so we're going to want cyan and blue. There's blue, there's cyan, and there's pink. We don't have an awful lot of it, so we'll be able to get the first bit started up, and then after that, it's like we're going to have to keep on going and look for new uh, petals. So right now I'm looking for my diluted mana pool. There we go. Oh, why am I trying that? I want to do that. There we go. Okay, so... I thought that was Creeper for a second there. <laughs> okay, there we go. We got our mana pool. Now, we're going to need one, two, one, one, two, one, one, two, one, one, two, one. Let's just see how many we can get. I doubt our mana pool right now has what we need oh, with the mana. Well, I can just split that in half like that. <coughs> Make that 21. So... We'll just need 21 of each. Same with that. There we go. The rest of these petals, let's just throw into here so they're not in my way. You just need those and those. All right. Let's try to do it as equally as possible. That way we have the ability to Try to get as many flowers ready as possible. 
we just had something teleport into our area. Might be time to go into Ars Magica to get an anti-teleporter. No, actually, if I remember correctly, Botania also has something kind of like that. Would you look at that? We had enough. Okay. So, now we need to head on in and find some seats. So, if you're wondering how I'm able to search using the NEI, what I did is I just double clicked that area and it gave me the ability to see whatever we might have available to us. Okay, we have only one seed for the fart of me. So I'm going to have to go over to the farm. And pick up some seeds from here. I sure hope we have more seeds. Barely. But guess what? We can go to the energy condenser. Condense it a bit to get what we want. Ooh, look at that zombie. Girl, look at that zombie. Oh, it's an angry zombie villager. Ooh, that is some scary stuff. Okay, so we need to go to the energy condenser to get more seeds. We were left with only four. It's too bad. Put one seed in. How much does it give me? 16 for it? Okay. Well, this is going to be fun, isn't it? Now, let's get that up there. Put the seeds over here. I'm going to need to put it like this. Alright. So, it should be one... Why can't I click you? There's something wrong with you. Um. <gasps> no! <laughs> well, great. Ruined up everything. Gonna have to clean that up later. What are you doing? Oh my goodness gracious. Okay, so. Okay, there we go. Got it working now. There we go, that's one. Okay, so I can't click it with the Emperor's Chalice as I thought I should be able to. That's kind of stupid. I guess I'm gonna have to use a bucket this time. Alright. Come here with your water. Alright. One, two, one, 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 and then there we go. sure I've got two. Alright, so once I'm done making all these hydro plants, I'll be right back. Alright, so I just miscounted by one, which is fine. Let's put the water in there, put the bucket up. I kind of cleaned out my area again by accident, but we'll just get back to that some other time. So, which backpack did I throw it in? I think it was the tools backpack. Um, wow, we are missing one mystical cyan petal. We got lots of light blue, but we don't have mystical cyan. 
which is one major factor that we need for the final part. Let's make sure I've got plenty of flight. Ooh, I've got three minutes of flight. Let's hurry up and get this sign in, is it? Yes, it is. All right, we gotta hurry up. That way I do not have to worry about. Whoa, I swear I just saw a flying skeleton over there. Wait, right there. Huh. I swore they were flying skeletons. Okay, let's get the light blue. One, two, one, 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 one. And then, there we go. We got 21 water flowers. Hydroon geese. Hydroon geese. I guess that's how you say it. Just friendly crustaceans. <laughs> All right. Down we go. Oh my lord. Um. Nobody. Surprised you didn't see me the first time around. gave me gunpowder okay so that's what teleported okay so I'd like to go start on the far corners over here because we still need dirt placed here so it's quite simple we flip-flop between flour and dirt Don't need that last piece there. Um, you know what? I messed up. There we go. All right. So we should start seeing them drinking from the water next to them like that. <clears throat> Let's do the same over here on this side. Whee! Yeah, we don't have nearly enough hydro on this. Something like that. <laughs> Like so, right there. And voila. Yeah, we didn't have enough. Oh well. So, I'm gonna say that's it for this episode. Next episode, we are going to cover mana spreaders spreading over to this location. Let's put our buddy down for now. Yeah, let's put it right there. So, I'll catch you guys uh, later. Bye-bye and enjoy.